Hello and welcome to India Today Any. Right now, I am at MasterChef set in Mumbai. Hi, I am Afrida Hussain and with me is the superstars from the world of food. Let's welcome Vikas Khanna, Garima Arora and Ranbir Brar. Thanks for joining us. Thank you very much. A pleasure my, being here. Yes. My first question to you, to Vikas, because you just said that you went to Arunachal Pradesh. What is the uniqueness of food from the Northeast? Um, I feel that Northeast is still uh, a wonderland for many of us. The ingredients, the spices, the cooking techniques, the people, the costumes, the festivals, everything is so unique and everything is so beautiful and so much of pride. And that is what I go to Northeast nonstop. I was uh, shooting Chap Charkut uh, two years ago, three years ago, before the pandemic in Mizoram. And I have never seen a harvest festival to be celebrated like that. The generosity of spirit, the food, the cuisine, the hospitality, it's unparalleled to any part of India. And uh, I work a lot in Arunachal Pradesh, especially in Zero Valley. Okay. Because I love the Apatani tribe. Okay. No bias. But I feel that <laughs> it has been helpful for me to understand India in a whole new spectrum. Okay. Very much the same question to you. Have you been to the Northeast and what is the uniqueness about the Northeast region? I, I think the Northeast, especially for me, has a very strong connect to uh, Bangkok as well, where okay. I have my restaurant. Uh, for me, the most special thing is, and which I draw inspiration from, is the use of uh, fresh herbs and fresh spices. I think uh, growing up, we've always eaten dry herbs, dry spices. Our cooking has been kind of primarily based on those ingredients. But the minute you use the same ingredient fresh, whether it's a uh, turmeric or even uh, coriander, so to speak, uh, the, uh, the sawtooth coriander, the one we were just talking right. about. The Mandhonia. minute Mandhonia. Mandhonia. So the minute you start using these fresh ingredients in your food, it kind of gives a very different dimension to recipes that you already kind of know and cook. So we explore that a lot in my restaurant. I love to eat like that. And I think this inspiration from the Northeast, I love to bring to my kitchen and my table. Okay. Ranbir Ji, you have never been to Assam. And what is the uniqueness about the region? Look, I have uh, been lucky to visit uh, four sisters out of the seven. Oh, super. So, uh, Arunachal... Uh, Nagaland, Assam, Sikkim, and I think that you know, ये लगता है कि इंसान को इतना ही understated होना चाहिए. You know, I think uh, the amount of quiet pride that Northeast takes in its culture uh, is outstanding. अगर खाने की बात करें तो आज की डेट में हम बहुत कुछ दुनिया से सीख रहे हैं फर्मेंटेशन हम दुनिया से सीख रहे हैं हमको वो नॉर्थ ईस्ट से सीखना चाहिए यू नो रूट टू फ्रूट का कॉन्सेप्ट हम दुनिया से सीख रहे हैं हमको वो नॉर्थ ईस्ट से सीखना चाहिए तो आई थिंक अगर हम ईस्टवर्ड्स देखें इन आर स्पेस नॉर्थ ईस्टवर्ड्स इफ यू सी देर इज अ लॉट टू लर्न एंड आई थिंक एसम फॉर मी स्पेशल बिकॉज इट इज ओपनिंग दैट गेट टू द नॉर्थ ईस्ट फॉर इंडिया You know, and I have to say this, Mr. Himanta Biswa Sarma sir has done that. Uh, he's opened that window okay. to the northeast for us. Yeah. Or, एक वो होता है ना कि वो खुल जा सिम सिम moment right. is happening for India, courtesy Assam, uh, and 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 uh, it's truly getting integrated with all the vibrancy and the pride that that northeast uh, deserves. Right. So, among the eight states, you have been to the four states. What is the most complicated dish you have tried, which is very hard to make it perfect, according to a chef? <laughs> For me, the trickiest dish to make is, uh, you know, duck with jute leaves. Okay. You know, even 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 uh -huh. even when we. Um, Cook duck here. Uh -huh. It's just so tricky for it to go wrong at so many places. Or jute, jo hai, hamari le naya concept hai. But jute ke, you know, the the use of jute leaves not just uh, as carbs but as a condiment, as a flavoring agent. I find it very very unique, and I like how this fermented note travels. It starts from Assam with jute leaf, bamboo. It gets deeper. As you go deeper into, because then fish uh, fermentation starts. So, जो fermented note का Assam में 
एक इंडक्शन होता है फॉर मी इट्स वेरी ब्यूटिफुल विद दैट दैट बैम्बू डक जूट स्पेस what is that one dish from north east which is hard you find hard to make it perfect i think it's not the dish but this ingredient jo khar jo ingredient hai humne bahut i think uski jo medicinal properties hain jo alkalizing properties hain i always feel aur hum apne restaurant mein bhi yahi koshish karte hain ke food should be nutritious it should do something for you for your gut and it's not simply feeding yourself or fulfilling yourself in terms of hunger so i've always uh, thought of using khad in a unique way maybe in our beverage menu in our uh, you know drink pairing so that is uh, something we trying to uh, still figure out at the restaurant and i think is the first thing i'm going to do once i wrap up here so you have a southeast connect to the northeast yeah that's, that's another <laughs> another way to say look at it <laughs> yeah so vikas you have been so so many times well, what is the one dish uh in uh, during hornbill hmm. in nagaland hmm. i had this uh, dish which hmm. was smoked fish okay so the river fish the river fi lake fish no it's a lake fish, lake fish because it's a lake ah, land lock ah, 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 okay so there's a lake fish which they smoke mm -hmm. but the fillet i have never had something generally when you're smoking a fish for so many days and you know it gets very dried but wahan pe kya hai ki because it's a full body fish what happens it's so moist and to stay so moist and it's not like it falls apart or it's not like you know what you're having dried sundered fish all over india but in nagaland they have figured out that you know what they do is that they have the living room where there's a fire burning and on top of that in lot of parts of northeast they have these bamboo ke ah. you know a draw like a it's shelf. called dhua sang dhua sang dhua sang to <laughs> smoking of the technique yes. so as they're cooking everything that top level gets it could be pork or it could be fish or anything but in in naga culture they have mastered the art of smoking and preservation i have never had smoked fish so delicious and we feel that sometimes it becomes overwhelmingly strong flavor but it was so amazing and special and one more thing i must pay pinpoint about the way they cook silkworms i was okay. just about to say the way they cook silkworm they are crunchy and delicious yeah. it's amazing actually yeah you're right and the fattiness that comes from silkworm yeah. is so unique yeah yeah नहीं नहीं बिल्कुल आई एग्री विद शेफ विकास ये जो आई ट्राइड द सिल्क वाम की करी व्हाट डू यू कॉल इट पोलू 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 इट्स अ डिफरेंस बिटवीन पाथ पोलू एंड मोगा पोलू पाथ मोगा सिल्क वाम एंड पाथ सिल्क वाम ओके द डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ सिल्क वाम या सो द सिल्क वाम की करी दैट आई ट्राइड पोलू बिहू में होता है यस एग्जैक्टली यस यस आई थिंक दैट समथिंग वेरी क्लेवर अबाउट यूजिंग सिल्क वर्म्स इन अ करी टू इम्पार्ट फैट आई डोंट थिंक दस मच फ्लेवर दैट यू गेट बट द वे यू कैन इम्पार्ट फैट विद द सिल्क वर्म्स इज अ वेरी इट्स इट्स समथिंग दैट आई वुड लव टू एक्सप्लोर टेक्सचर इज वेल यस इट्स लाइक आपने कुछ ट्राई किया देखिए सो आई थिंक एवरीबॉडी इज ट्राइड सिल्क वर्म करी इन बिहू अभी तो मुंबई में यू नो पॉप अप्स में सिल्क वर्म करी मिलती है Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> good, good, good. <laughs> But I, I had uh, in at the Hornbill Festival, I had uh, the first time I had silkworms was not in Assam on Bihu. It was actually in the Hornbill Festival right. six years ago. Okay. Um, in Nagaland. In Nagaland, hmm. and that was November, the winter worms, not hmm. the uh, you know the spring worms. Slightly firmer. मुझे you know वो अभी भी याद बट लाइक आई सेड कहीं पे आप धुआसान बोल देते हैं नागा कल्चर में मेफुंग बोलते हैं उसको द किचन द स्मोकिंग स्पेस इन द किचन कॉल्ड मेफुंग इन द नागा ट्राइब सो वो जो एक कल्चर है किचन बीइंग द सेंटर ऑफ द होम यू नो द फायर बीइंग द सेंटर ऑफ द होम आई लव दैट कल्चर एवरीथिंग हैपन्स अराउंड फूड चाहे वो वॉम्थ के लिए क्यों ना हो चाहे वो फायरवुड के लिए क्यों ना हो बट वो जो एवरीबडी गैदर्स अराउंड फूड वाला जो कल्चर है ना वो बहुत ब्यूटीफुल है और एंड दैट अक्रॉस नॉर्थ ईस्ट ना यू नो आई थिंक इट्स वर्थ मैंशनिंग दैट इवेंचुअली यू नो इवेंचुअली वॉट रियली ब्रिंग्स अस टूगेदर इज फूड ना Yes, I must appreciate you dig into the histories. In even in your YouTube videos, I have seen that. I must appreciate that fact, honey. Thank you so much. Uh, there's, I think, I don't think any conversation of food is just about a recipe, right, anyways. Right, right, right. I think right. recipe is just an outcome, right, of a lot of things, and they just need to also get a mention at least. Okay. So, what will be your advice to any youngster who may want to start a food sane business? 
uh, based on the northeast food uh, will it be a viable business idea i i think it's it's a perfectly viable business idea to uh, to open a northeast food space anywhere in the country uh, for three reasons one is like i said the window uh, to the northeast is now open two is as a country we are more culturally aware and culturally conscious than we ever were today we want to explore cultures microcultures micro cosmoses of of these beautiful cuisines that that uh, occur in india and third i think uh, by itself there is so much diversity and variety that you can pick and choose where you want to start from i always say whenever you starting um to introduce a new new cuisine you start with the familiar stuff first and then take people to the unknown territory there is that greed sometimes to uh, to wow people with the unknown but then when you start a business you should start with the known flavors the known dishes what connects to the palate and then take them on a ride with the fermented stronger akuni sort of flavors i think that will work <laughs> मुझे वो बात कहने दो ये for people we run to the western world to think about oh this is my sour cream and this is my sugar but that is more like because what happens in the when you do it in the bamboo it's breathing so when you set a yogurt you, you know it's i have never had, and the way they use it in the food also it's kind of amazing but i still feel it's very underrated okay coming to the master chef what is the specialty about these two contestants from assam nayan and santa I think uh, chef you should talk about Nayan jo aap leke aaye ho usko and then Shanta ka to Nayan ka maine sirf Instagram dekha tha uh, Nayan Jyoti ka uh, from um, um Tinsukia and uh, sirf for Instagram mein I was totally in love with what he was cooking wo jo uh, north east ki light show na badi filtered life hoti hai <laughs> वो अरबों पे हॉलीवुड खर्चता है फिल्टर्स लगाने के लिए नॉर्थ ईस्ट में वो भगवान ही फिल्टर्स क्लाउड्स के लगा के देते हैं इससे फोटोग्राफ्स उसकी बहुत सुंदर थी एंड आई थॉट दिस इज अमेजिंग एंड उसके पापा उसको थिंग ही वाज वांटेड हिम टू टेक केयर ऑफ द यू नो टी फार्म्स एंड वर्क अ जॉब तो मुझे लगा कि वी शुड टेक अ रिस्क एंड गो टू हिज हाउस टॉक टू हिज फादर बिकॉज ऐसे टैलेंट को बाहर निकलने की बहुत ज़रूरत है और ये हम कहते हैं कि यू नो बहुत दरवाजे होते हैं लाइफ में आगे बढ़ने के लिए बट एज अ मास्टर शेफ प्लेटफॉर्म वी फील वी शुड ब्रेक ऑल दो डोर्स एंड ग्रेट अपॉर्चुनिटीज डूरिंग उसके घर पर पूरा खाना बना था मेरे लिए देर वॉज ऑलमोस्ट लाइक सेवनटीन डिशेज मैंने हर चीज़ डॉक्यूमेंट करके फटाफट रेसिपीज डॉक्यूमेंट करके अपनी बुक में डालने की तैयारी है पर एक चीज़ मैं नहीं फैला वहाँ का पोमेलो मैं कभी नहीं पल नहीं भूला मैं वहाँ के लबाव टेंग एंड यू नो वो नहीं सिर्फ आपका जो रेगुलर डिफरेंट सिट्रस थे और आई वॉज सो इंस्पायर्ड दैट वी डिड अ होल चैलेंज ऑन सिट्रस जस्ट बिकॉज यू वॉज सो इंस्पायर्ड बाई तिन सुखिया एंड द टी फार्म एंड नैन स्टोरी एंड पेरेंट्स दैट हाउ दे आर सो राइट नाउ इंस्पायर्ड एंड उसके पापा ने बोला कि मैं चाहता हूँ कि हर पेरेंट को अपने बच्चे की आवाज़ सुननी चाहिए एंड लिसन टू देर हैप्पीनेस अबाउट दूसरेंट फ्राम द I think the other contestant is uh, Shanta. So Shanta is uh, Assamese, but from the Gorkha community of Assam. So she has uh, a very interesting combination of a fighter spirit and also the Assamese pride that comes with it. And it uh, shows in her cooking. It shows in uh, everything that she does. All the stories that she brings uh, forward. Uh, yeah, I remember uh, the first time she walked into the kitchen. Since then to today, her graph as a chef has grown. but also this need and uh, need to kind of show the pride of both the communities she represents the assamese and the gorkha communities also kind of are coming forth so if uh, there was a time for northeast uh, cuisine it's now and the fact that we have two such strong contestants in the master chef kitchen from that part of the and country and it's a big platform for them as well exactly. from that so i think that's a testament that we have you know them the best cooks in the country today are coming from northeast it's a testament to what that part of the country has to offer to the rest of the country so yeah if there was ever a time for the northeast it's now ranveer 
देखिए आई थिंक वट आई रियली लाइक अबाउट बोथ नयन ज्योति एंड सांता इज दैट इनोसेंस यू नो द इनोसेंस दैट दे रिप्रजेंट एंड दे ब्रिंग टू द मास्टर शेफ किचन इज सो इट्स सो इम्पॉर्टेंट फॉर एनी आर्टिस्ट टू बी इनोसेंट फर्स्ट बिकॉज यू कैन ओनली यू नो यू कैन ओनली वर्क ऑन एन एम टी कैनवस राइट एंड दे कम अक्रॉस एज एज दैट एम टी कैनवस दैट्स रेडी टू अब्जॉर्ब कलर्स एंड दैट आई एम ऑलवेज इंस्पायर्ड लुकिंग एट दैम वो जो सादगी है ना नॉर्थ ईस्ट की वो वो हर चैलेंज में लेके आते हैं साथ में यू नो और किसी भी आर्टिस्ट को वो ह्यूमिलिटी वो सादगी वो इनोसेंस हमेशा इंस्पायर करेगी वी आर शेफ्स बी वी आर ऑल्सो आर्टिस्ट यू नो एंड दैट्स वॉट्स इंस्पायरिंग फॉर अस दैट इज द फ्लेवर द लेंथ टू द शो एंड यू नो जो एक ग्राफ होता है ना कंटेस्टेंट का सो देयर कलनरी ग्राफ इज गेटिंग ऑब्वियसली गेटिंग बेटर बट देयर अबिलिटी टू रिप्रजेंट देयर इनोसेंस इन देयर फूड इज ऑल्सो गेटिंग बेटर जो मुझे लगता है कि जब आप अपने वेन यू कैन पुट योर सेल्फ इन योर फूड uh you know uh, and let the world take notice that is the ultimate objective of self expression yeah to wo mujhe bada acha lagta hai unke bare mein that's Which what i really like in the video of yours making tekeli pitha hmm. what are the other pithas you have tried <laughs> and are you guys planning to do some pitha challenge in master chef <laughs> master chef mein kuch yeah <laughs> no <Kuch> ideas <laughs> main tekeli pitha जब मैंने देखा था आई वेरी इंस्पायर्ड कि किस तरह यू नो आप एक केटल का ढक्कन भी यूज कर सकते हैं यू कैन यूज द लिड ऑफ अ केटल एंड द स्टीम ऑफ द टी टू हैव योर ब्रेकफास्ट कंपनी में नीचे चाय बन रही है ऊपर पीठा स्टीम हो रहा है एंड यू नो आई फाउंड इट वेरी इनजेनस एंड दैट इज वाई आई सेट दिस हैज टू गो अप एंड बी स्पोकन अबाउट पर ये जो पीठा कल्चर है नॉर्थ ईस्ट का स्पेशली आसाम का सिर्फ बेहू बिहू में ही तीन दर्जन पीठा रेसिपीज तो मैंने नोट करी hmm. uh, मेरा फेवरेट जो है वो ब्लैक तिल वाला पीठा है दैट समथिंग दैट आई रियली रियली एडमायर आई आई थिंक देर इज नो बेटर सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ राइस देन अ पीठा एंड देर इज नो बेटर हार्वेस्ट डिश दिस पंजाबी सेइंग दिस बट देर इज नो बेटर हार्वेस्ट डिश देन अ पीठा एंड द वे इट सेलिब्रेट्स the harvest i think it's beautiful one closer question to you what your what are your future movie plans <laughs> we don't know ji dekhiye uh, i think uh, acting came as a by product of yeah. of self expression mm. if something really appeals to you uh, as a space you want to explore it uh, because you don't get to sometimes explore spaces in your head otherwise mm. in your daily life if there is something that appears on the horizon which appeals to me i'll take it up Yeah, Garima. One question to you is: You want to uh, see more regionalism in Master Chef this time? I have seen somewhere. What is your uh, take on this? Uh, I think there's a need from both ends uh, to kind of uh, express uh, where we come from, uh, the communities that we come from, the states that we come from. One from the side of the cook. You know, we want to show who we are, where we come from in in within India, and also from the part of the diner. Yeah. They are very inquisitive to see that India me or kya kya khana banta hai. Mm-hmm. You know, ham regions me apne ab gharo me kaise khana khate hain. So ye dono tarike se there's it's the need of the hour to kind of fulfill both these uh, needs. My last question to Vikas is: These days, shocking recipes like Nutella biryani and chocolate coated fried chicken are trending on internet. Have you ever tried such unthinkable combinations? I'll rather not commenting. <laughs> uh, just did you try? मैंने कम मैंने काफ़ी कुछ try किया हुआ है अतरंगी मैं आप देखें आप कहीं पर भी मैं भी इंडिया में हूँ तो लोग लेके आते हैं मेरे एक्सपेरिमेंटेशन एंड आई फील इट्स अ सेल्फ एक्सप्रेशन एंड जनरली आई डोंट कॉमेंट ऑन फूड लाइक दैट एंड इट्स बेटर ऑफ लाइक दिस एंड I just want people to be free to create what they want to create. You know, this is a beauty of imagination and creation. Yeah thank you for joining us today at India today any thank you sir thank you thank you very much thank you it's a pleasure being here aur uh, tamam northeast ko pehle to shukriya thank you very much for uh, sending such beautiful food and beautiful talent to the master chef kitchen we are celebrating india like never before through its food only on master chef india